Good morning everyone, welcome uh, to a special moment for me. Uh, you are about to witness the first uh, photography video that I've ever recorded. Uh, actually it is the first video that I have ever recorded. I never did videos, I never edited videos. So uh, the last uh, two weeks uh, I've been processing this video uh, into what you're about to watch. And uh, it's been quite a steep uh, learning curve. I've already discovered such uh, <laughs> uh, new worlds for me. It's, uh, yeah, it's very interesting. Uh, very creative and I really like that. Uh, so hopefully you will too. Uh, for example, I already discovered that uh, the sound in the video was uh, uh, yeah, pretty poor. <laughs> so I bought this uh, microphone that you're listening to now uh, after I recorded this video. So hopefully the next uh, video will have uh, a lot better audio. Um, yeah, if you're uh, interested in photography, uh, especially nature photography, landscapes, birds, uh, animals, uh, then like and subscribe to this channel because uh, that's the kind of content that I will create. Um, yeah, and please uh, leave a comment uh, below uh, yeah, about what, uh, what your thoughts are about this video. If you like it, uh, what I can improve. And uh, yeah, I can only learn from that. So uh, please uh, uh, join me and uh, let's watch this video together. And I hope you will like it. Thanks for watching and uh, see you on the next one. Bye. Welcome to my channel, my first uh, video here, and as you can see, uh, things don't uh, go as planned as usual. I wanted to go to this uh, climbing tower to hopefully look over the forest and uh, catch some foggy lights, but uh, somehow the tower is closed, so. Uh, never been to this area I walked through the forest a little and um, yeah the, there weren't much uh, nice compositions there so um, there's a, an area a bit further that's a bit clearer of forest and hopefully uh, we can get some shots there so that's where we're uh, heading now it's just uh, a couple of minutes further and then we'll, uh, we'll see how it goes from there thank you for watching this channel if you like what I'm doing Please like and subscribe to the channel and we will uh, yeah we will continue this journey together and find these places. This is not I'm gonna learn from this. And that's what I'm doing. I'm learning. I'm learning to make movies. I'm learning to make better photos. And if you want to learn with me, then just like and subscribe.
shot here? Actually, it, it is my second shot. I took one at the, at the parking lot where, uh, where I put the car. But there were so many people with dogs walking around that I decided uh, not to film it. But it was a pretty average shot, so uh, hopefully it turns out good. If it is, I'll show it to you now. There's uh, not much going on here. It's just a, a bunch of trees, birch trees, and an open field. And yeah, all the background is covered with fog. I'll probably end up cropping this to uh, a one by one square image. Because there's just too much. Yeah, of nothing. It's coming through a bit, so hopefully it will create some, uh, yeah, some beautiful light uh, in a couple of minutes. But the fog is very dense, so it can go two ways: it can get nothing, or it can be a beautiful morning. We'll never know, and that's the beauty of photography. Every day is different, so let's take this shot, and if it's any good, I'll show it to you. So this is what I framed up. It's just an, uh, oh, I'll put this away. It's just a tree with, uh, yeah, with a lot of nothing, and it's, it actually uh, can, can be a nice shot. I think it will be a black and white, and probably a square, so this will be off a little bit of the top. And um, yeah, it's, it's not a portfolio image, but in conditions like this, it's uh, well, they were well worth shooting, I think. So I've found this uh, group of trees. Uh, that they are yeah, a bit standing out of the of the fog, and I especially like this this left one. So I'm going uh, towards there and have a look if I can find a nice composition. It's going to be quite difficult, but uh, we'll see how it goes. I think I found a shot here. As you can see, there are some. Oh, let's have a look. Trees over there. And I particularly like that they are getting from big to small, and it looks like they are falling down. Uh, actually, one of them is laying down on the ground, and I think it'll be a nice square image. So I put another lens on, it's the 40 to 150. And, uh, I'm just trying to frame the shot up. I'll show it to you in a minute. So this is what I framed up. You can see this, uh, uh, yeah, larger tree and the small trees. They are all hanging to one side, and there's one tree uh, laying down. I think it will make a nice uh, image. It's, it's pretty minimalistic, but uh, yeah, there's there's something to it. I think. So we'll just uh, take the shot. We got F8, ISO 200. I'll probably overexpose a little. It's making it a little brighter. Still, if you look at the histogram, there are no, uh, there's nothing blown out or nothing too dark. So we can uh, do anything in it in Lightroom, anything we wish. So we'll uh, take the shot and uh, it will probably end up being a square but we'll, uh, we'll see that on the computer got a five second timer on it
So once again, welcome to this uh, channel. Um, yeah, it's the first video. But why did I start this channel? Um, yeah, basically, I'm, I'm, I love photography. I love being out here, being in nature. Uh, the peace of, of the early mornings, the sunsets. Most of people are usually uh, still sleeping when, uh, when I'm out here. But somehow today there are uh, uh, I think about a hundred dogs uh, walking around here with their uh, bosses, but uh, their owners. <laughs> but it's uh, it's quite fun. It's uh, it's always peaceful, and it's always nice to have some uh, some good images. And that's also why I started this uh, with this video because um, you can say why did you start it? There are a lot of great ones out there with people living in epic locations, shooting beautiful mountains and seascapes and wildlife in, in South Africa. There are couples that I, I watch regularly uh, every week. But uh, yeah, there, there are not many people uh, living in a beautiful country like I am. And uh, yeah, this is a nature photography paradise. Because there's, uh, yeah, there, there's stunning uh, mountain, uh, stunning mountains here. Beautiful wildlife. No, actually, there's none of it. <laughs> I probably live, live in the dullest country of them all. This is this is the Netherlands, and uh, yeah, most people will uh, know it with uh, with windmills and cheese. And uh, yeah, it's also known because it's flat. It's probably one of the flattest countries on the on the planet. And um, yeah, it's one of the most overcrowded countries on the planet and that makes it uh, very difficult for uh, photography there's still some some nature left but most of it is uh, conserved uh, and, and maintained by uh, by the government so there's not uh, real old forests or wild wildlife there is some but not uh, very much and uh, yeah we'll just have to deal with it and uh, work with it try to find uh, stuff and that makes it uh, a bit harder probably than when you're living in the Canadian Rockies or uh, can visit uh, the Kruger National Park in South Africa uh, yeah or when you're living on the coast somewhere in, in the southern of France or, uh, or Scotland or England so this is what I'm dealing with just just flat stuff sand you know, forest uh, and just uh, yeah try to make the best of it and hopefully uh, yeah, I will uh, be able to, to make some good content for you that uh, you will keep watching. And yeah, of course, I will go to, uh, to other countries uh, as well in the future. But uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a dad uh, with two little boys, one three-year-old, one of four months old at the moment. So it's, uh, it's not always going to be easy to go out here and uh, search for this, uh, these images. And sometimes I bring my son with me. And sometimes I don't, like today. So uh, it's always a struggle to find time to uh, to do this uh, this kind of stuff. So let's uh, move on and uh, see if we can find another uh, shot. So I did find another shot uh, on my way to the car. This, I found this, yeah, this lone tree here, and it's yeah, it's standing out in nothing due because of the fog. And it just caught my attention because it's so it's so simple and yeah, it's so nice. And it will probably be a little bit more zoomed in because this is the the movie uh, uh, frame, but. Uh, yeah, I, I quite like it. Also, the, the grasses in the for, foreground here, they are a bit unsharp. And yeah, it's just, it just caught my eye and I uh, just uh, really uh, kind of like it. Uh, there's a little layering in it because of the fog. And uh, yeah, I think this, uh, this shot will, uh, will turn out nice. I'll properly crop it to a square. So uh, the, the sides will be off a little bit on this side. On the other side too. And, uh, yeah, that's it.
If you like this uh, the channel, if you like the content, please like and subscribe. And uh, just push the thumbs up button. And uh, we'll make some more, uh, some more videos together. And uh, yeah, we'll see where it goes from here. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, see you on the next one. Bye.